Yo, what's going on guys? JBH here and today I'm back on NASCAR Heat 4 where we are hitting up the big one. This is the longest race on the NASCAR Sprint Cup calendar. The one and only Coke 600 at the Charlotte Motor Speedway. Now the Charlotte Motor Speedway is sort of widely regarded as the home of NASCAR in the US. It's where all the sort of teams are based. It's where the NASCAR Hall of Fame is based. They have an insane museum at this track. I've been here once when I was a little kid, uh, but it was ages ago. So <laughs> to be honest, I don't really remember much. But yeah, no, I've been really looking forward to this event. Um, um, now, the race is 600 miles, but I'm not going to lie, I'm not going to be doing the full 600 because in real life that can take uh, anywhere from like three and a half to five hours. It is literally like an endurance stock car event. So as per usual, I'm doing 50% race distance, so 300 miles, 200 laps. Uh, so yeah, still going to be a long race uh, in the end anyway. Now, last time out at Talladega, I managed to grab a win. We were struggling uh, off the restarts and uh, yeah, there was some weird bugs and whatnot going on. So I'm hoping we don't experience that here today. Um, but in practice, I've been a little bit off the pace, not going to lie. Uh, our one lap pace is not too good. However, our long run pace isn't actually too bad. And the, uh, the car seems to be good um, in terms of its balance and tire wear over that long run. So hopefully we can actually charge through the pack towards the end of the stint. And uh, yeah, I mean, it's the one track where you sort of really want to be good on the long run because this sort of green flag runs really do stretch out. But yeah, without any further ado, we'll jump into this race. I'm just going to go and do a quick qualifying session and set the grid, and then, yeah, we'll be good to go. All right, so that's qualifying done. Managed to qualify 12th, so not too bad. As I said, our one-lap pace isn't too good right now. Uh, so, yeah, we're around four tenths off the pace on one lap, which is a little bit scary, but that's just NASCAR Heat 4. It's the way it is. I'm interested to see what our pace is like here when we get started. Yeah, here we go. Expecting around two hours of racing. And we're off. I'm not sure if starting on the bottom is a good thing right now. We'll soon find out. But as you can see here, do have a couple little frame rate stutters at times. Don't know what it is with this game, but I cannot seem to sort of optimize the graphics. You're really limited as to what you can actually do, to be honest. Oh, not sure whether to make that move, but he pulled out. Oh, Jesus. Sliding up that racetrack. All of a sudden, really angles down between three and four. You really have to sort of try and hold the bottom because the car slides up big time. Turn one's a lot friendlier. It's feeling a little bit loose so far, but we're up into seventh. Yeah, apologies for any stutters that you may see. We got behind us Kurt Busch. We got a pack of cars. All right, I'm just going to let him have that because he's on a mission. And I'm not getting involved in anything because we have, as I said, and I'll keep saying 300 miles. That I can't even fathom doing that in real life. I mean, I did do the Coke 600 a couple times on iRacing where they actually do the 600 miles and. Well, I didn't finish any of them. <laughs> Every attempt, I crashed out at some point during the race. It's just, it's hard because this is a really, really fast racetrack. Like, the banking on these corners is so great that you can really hold it wide open. See, I'm lifting off now, but that's just because I've am got a gap behind and I wouldn't mind saving some tyre whilst these guys battle in front of us. Trying to work that right rear too hard just yet. It's feeling a little bit loose so far compared to what it was in practice, but... Wow, that was your best 29.571, actually, that's not too bad. That's just faster than what we did in <laughs> qualifying. I guess it's the draft, but... I'm really, really looking forward to NASCAR Heat 5. Comes out in just under a month at the time of this video being reported. And I'm hoping, once again, like we say each year on these NASCAR games, that... There'll be an improvement to the physics because that is still, I think, the biggest thing it's lacking. Yeah, we got some pace here. We're making moves. Oh, oh. Just thinking about it, but. I got nothing but time. To watch those temps. I'm sort of guessing on the tape, to be completely honest. Oh, damn. Oh, Jesus. She does not want to grip through three and four. Right, 247, we're good on temp. See what this high line's all about. Screwed that up. It's going to be interesting to see what the sort of day-night transition is around here because... Oh, caution's out. Never mind. 
Um, I'm not going to pick because, well, we've only done a couple laps and 88% isn't too bad, but as you can see that is a 5% difference. Alrighty, here we go. Coming back to the green, restarting in eight. Interesting restarting on the outside this time. Got to get down to the bottom. I can't remember who ran, who uh, ran, won this race. I think it was, I think it was Brad in front of us who won it in real life. I can't remember. I know Chase was aggravatingly close to winning it, but sort of got screwed over by a late race caution. Just so, there's so many races going on. There's like, well, there's one every Saturday or Sunday, and then one every Wednesday. Oh, Jesus! Uh, no, that's not gone well. Okay, oops. Just tap the back of Brad, and then that was it. And we got for damage. If this was uh, high racing, we'd be done and dusted, but a little bit of aero damage. And they really checked up. Oops. All right, well, it's all right. Long way to go. We'll get him back. Got some long run pace, I think. The last thing we wanted was damage. What a prick. Ugh. You know Joseph never stabbed the brakes in the middle of a corner in a stock car. You are going to go in the wall. Basic, basic rookie area. Era, era, blah, blah, blah. I can't even English. All right. Oh, Jesus. Really kicks his ass out coming off a of four, I tell you what. Draft. No, don't hit the cushion. A uh, cushion, apron, dickhead. <laughs> uh, it is three in the morning. I have woken up real early to. <laughs> to film this video or record this video I'm not not firing on all eight cylinders right now my brain is just blur come on Kyle give it up boy now that bottom I can't it's interesting I keep turning in too late into one or two Sort of arcing the entry a little bit too much. Unlike this one where you have to really on down to the bottom. <laughs> Alright, who's in front of us? Who we got next? Who is next on the reel? Chris Busher. I don't know why it just wants to do that. I think it's if I were to tighten it up for that exit, it would just tighten me up everywhere else and I don't really feel that tight right now. I just wanna have it nice and free. Man, I talk so much shit sometimes, I swear to God. Oh, no, too deep. Alright, you got. So weird, you've got to really unwind the wheel unnaturally to stop that arse end from kicking out off a of four. Right, we, need, we need a pit stop, we've got damage, and I can tell it's slowing us down a little bit. Tighten this baby up. She's getting loose. Uh, okay, that was not what I wanted. It's interesting, I'm starting to get the idea of how much you have to arc that entry into three. You gotta hit the bottom straight away through one and two. Eric Almarola, Daniel Suarez, past Chase. Although, continue to miss the bottom of this freaking turn one and two. Uh, another caution right now, we're definitely gonna pit here because. We need some fuel to get to the end of this stage. Get away with one can. Yep. Uh. Alright, all four tyres and fuel. Lost a couple spots. Did we gain spot? No. We're yeah, we lost green. a couple spots. Alright, anyway. Here we go, back to green. I think all these cautions have been somewhere towards the back because I haven't seen any of them. 
No, I reckon the AI took two tires because I took a can a can of fuel, so I, either that or I had a ridiculously slow pit stop. Anyway. Oh, shit. Cars everywhere. Uh, oh, Jesus. Bro, why are we going like two miles an hour? Where's the bottom at? I need a gap. Jeez, man. We dropped like six spots. You do not want to start on the outside around here. You ain't going anywhere. Oh, actually, I'll tell you what. Probably that 62 car. Yeah, Brendan Gorn. I bet he didn't take tyres. Probably stayed out. Start up that racetrack. Alright, well, we gained a couple back. But we are way behind the leader. I'm going to struggle to get anything out of this stage. If there's a time and place to go to the front, it is now. Yeah, you really got to slow it up to hit the bottom on the exit of that three and four. Oh, another caution, man. What's going on? You can't keep their shit together around here. We're restarting 11th, and we are on the bottom, so actually this might help us out a little bit. See if we can nab a few positions here early on. No, Kyle, don't do it. Don't do it. Come on, frame rate. Three wide. You. So much better. So he started on the bottom. Three wide again. Oh, this is gonna be messy. Right. Semi slide job. Pulled it off. Up into fourth. Oh, no, fifth. Bowman's still there. Come on. Come on. Right, what is it with the sounds of this game? I don't know if you guys can hear that, but it's like some weird sound going on from these cars. I hope they fix that on NASCAR Heat 5. I don't know if it's just me or if everyone sort of gets it, but it's really annoying. Bruh. Another caution? Are you kidding me? What is going on? It's like the fifth caution in one stage. Now we're starting on the outside again. Jeez, man. So many damn cautions. I see two cars already out of the race. We're not even a quarter of the way through yet. Come on, Denny. Oh shit. No. Ah. Fucking Carl Bush, I swear to God. What a prick! Up against the wall. You! Just about <laughs> nearly turned uh, old boy Chase Elliott, or young boy. Oh, boy. Whenever I think of Elliott, I think of his dad. Stick her up the inside. Laps you got five to go. Can we get a top three? We've got some pace. Uh, provided I don't slide up and rub the wall. Jesus. Got the entry of that one all wrong. Come on. That Mustang power.
I, I reckon we got some pace here today, lads. I reckon we got... I mean, not one lap pace, but we got some pace to stick with the pack. Usually our issue is the other way around. We, like, clear off into the distance after three laps and then, uh... Oop. No, don't hit the fence. Oh, you toss pot. Right, if I could just go, like, five laps without making a single mistake, I might actually be able to do something with this race, but... More damage again. Right, three wide, Jesus. Now that. Alright, two laps to go. See if we can hold on for a top five in stage one. Just don't make any more stupid bloody mistakes, man. There you go, hit the bottom. Oh, hit the bottom too hard. So hit or miss with his freaking entry. Really gotta guess it right. Right. There we go. You gotta get that arc right. You gotta sort of zoop on down to the bottom. And a high, exit low. <laughs> high in, low out. <laughs> uh, love me some cool runnings. Come on. Uh. Loose. Alright, so stage one, we're going to get a top five, not too bad. Had a load of dramas there with hitting walls and bouncing off people, but... Okay, so no changes to the car, just going to continue on uh, where we are. I, I was thinking of tightening it up, but to be honest, you know, the percentages right front to right rear aren't too bad, so... Thankfully, we're restarting on the bottom, although we're starting back in seventh, so... Lost spaces, lost spots again on pit road. We have to have a talk to the guys after this one. Oh, okay. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. Oops. It's not going well. Ooh, three wide. Come on. Sort it out, guys. No. Very grip in the middle right now. It's all on the bottom. It's an attempted slide job that went <laughs> went very poorly. Wiggling. Twenty nine two. Woo. I'm moving. Four cars got some pace on the high line, I tell you what. Uh, slide job. Done him. That's one way of doing it. Alright, up in the force. Let's see if we have anything for these front three. We're quicker than I think that's Eric Jones. We're quicker than him at the start, so. We should be able to catch him soon. Denny Hamlin is next up. What are we? Eight of forty-seven on the second stage. Surely that's enough. Come on, Mustang pace, let's go. Just can't get to the bottom.
Oh, another caution, Jesus. Oh, this is interesting because Denny Hamlin is the only one pitting. All right, so I've decided to stay out. A couple guys pitted. Um, not quite halfway through this stage yet, so we would have to um, pit again anyway. Didn't want to give up this track position that I've just worked so hard for. Plus, restarting third is on the bottom, so we could get to the lead here and check out, hopefully. We're catching these guys up really quickly before the caution came out. Set up the racetrack. Come on. So over, ch sort of charge the entry there to get down to the bottom. Nailed it. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Stay low, stay low. Side by side for the lead. Oh, Jesus. Yellow. All right. Just took a piece out of my right rear. No worries. See how it is. <coughs> Coronavirus. Oh, slide job. Oh, no, it's crisscrossing me. Oops. Didn't quite think that one through. <laughs> Get it done on the outside, come on. A great old ding dong for the lead going on right here. Problem is we got Eric Jones in third that's ready to take a piece of it. Can't get it done. Just finds a way every time. Come on, surely. Oh shit! Couldn't unwind the wheel because he's there. Oh, and surely this is it. Uh, no, now Eric Jones coming. <laughs> Jesus, man, I just can't catch a break. Get one pass done and just concede another one. This is one heck of a scrap. I swear, <laughs> leaders changed like ten times in the last five laps. All right. Oh, no, 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 no. That's that's a bit rude. That's a bit rude. Oh, Jesus. Whenever you come three wide off a corner on one of these narrow sort of cookie cutter 1.5 mile speedways, then it always ends badly. Anyway, well, I've just gone from first to third, so I just cannot get the moves done. They just keep fighting back every single time. All right, let's try it again. All right, awesome. We needed that. We definitely needed that caution because we are going to pit. All right, well, obviously we pitted and a lot of the guys from the last um, caution stayed out. They've now gone to the front, so we've got to try and get to the bottom because these guys have older tyres than us, much older tyres than us. This is going to be really interesting. Itchy brain. Oh, no, don't do that. Oh, bosh. Oh, 
Well, Truex a little bit loose, but you stay out. That's what happens. I am going to the front. Oh, some damage. Yeah, that was a that was a slightly large bump draft. All right. Well, Kurt, who was part of that sort of group of three, is now just falling into the pack. But Eric Jones in the twenty is. gotten through that quite well to be honest oh no here comes Kyle no oh, go away yes, I got aero damage now so we can be a little bit down on pace what is it ninety eight so it's not too bad it's just enough though this track does require a decent amount of downforce and straight line speed at the same time. Got it. Got to have everything optimized. Um, and Eric Jones just cleared off into the distance. bottom come on let's go ah, struggling for pace on this run Man, I am slow I must have really hit that guy pretty hard because that pace has definitely dropped God dang it. I'm gonna be in a bush sandwich here in a second. Alright, well, that helps. Let's right, see if we can actually chase down this. DeWalt 20 car. Oh, Jesus. It's tying up a little bit. Damn. Oh, come on. I just need some consistency. I keep making stupid mistakes. Damn, that really tightened up just then. I mean, in real life, yeah, if you, uh, if you run sort of into the night when the track cools off, you technically get more grip because the temperature in the track is cooler. Therefore, every, well, the engine runs better, the tires don't overheat as much, and naturally the car tends to become tighter. I didn't actually think that was a thing on NASCAR Heat 4 that they'd be able to sort of simulate, but it would seem right now that we are tightening up. I mean, we have got a little bit of damage on the front end, which would also probably tighten it up a little bit. Loss of downforce, but just thinking whether or not to make a change on this next stop. I'm just pushing up the racetrack. Far out. Nine. We've got two to go. Let's see if we can punch ourselves back into the second place spot. Four wheel drift off of number two. Um, let's make this move. Gotta get to the inside. All right, last lap in the stage. Uh, hold the bottom, come on. Yes, got it done. There we go, all right. Well, second in stage two, we'll take that. Just. Try and keep with this 20 car. I'm going to loosen this thing up a little bit because it's getting a bit tight. Um, hopefully it doesn't stab us in the back, but this track's only going to get quicker. Um, it's, well, 
assuming it's only going to get quicker. Alrighty, restarting second. Try and get down to the bottom as quickly as we can. Made a couple of adjustments, like I said. And uh, hopefully this thing's going to be slightly looser than what it was. Get to the bottom. Actually, I'll tell you what. Screw it. Let's see if we can just go around the top side. All right. Come on, clear him, clear him, clear him. Try and clear him. Oh, chopped him a bit, but we are in the lead. You! Bit rude, but it's NASCAR. Do what we want. All right. Oh, wait. This. Oh, yeah. I forgot. There's not. There's four stages in this race. Not. Not three. So we've actually got another 47 laps before <laughs> the final stage. Crap, didn't see him there. Ah, couldn't hit the bottom because the old mate stuck his nose in. Damn it, Kurt. Cooperate, Mudgy. We don't have short run pace, that's for sure. Definitely have much better long run pace. Shoot back on down to the bottom. Let's see if we can... Must admit, it's definitely been one of the most fun races in terms of actual racing the AI. We have passed and been passed about 400 times so far in this race. I tell you what, I'm right, just going to let him have that bit there. Try and conserve a little bit of this tyre. I think I might actually try that in the final stint. Just instead of trying to race these guys, let's just let them do their thing. See if we can save the tyre for the actual long run. But to be honest, we actually haven't had a long run so far. Everything in this race has just been, you know, 20 lap run caution, 20 lap run caution. Oop, so we'll... I'll just sit back here and hopefully get him on a long run. It's sort of hard to plan races with these stages. I mean, well, I mean, it's not as easy, but can't really plan what's going to happen in you know, 100 laps time because everything's going to change. Definitely makes it a lot more entertaining for the fans, so I do like it. It's uh, it's sort of hard though because I do miss the whole sort of iRacing where, you know, you do 100 laps, green flag, you know, you sort of get two green flag pit stops in there as well, so made it feel more of an in an endurance race. So, oh, Jesus, that's loose. Right, how are we looking? All right, right front, right rear is not too bad, although I'm not driving it off the front like I was in this stint before. Splitter gone. See that? Another caution. Okay. Green, green, green. Let's boogie. Still Got a car coming inside now. And we shuffled Kurt out. <laughs> See you later. the wall, don't brush the wall. Oh, they are right in that outside line. Does not get any close to 
or closer than that. It just sucks because every time I seem to come off a four, I get these weird stutters and I can't actually concentrate. <laughs> Stupid game. Anyway. Can't make that high line work. Oh, and hay fever season is going to be the death of me, I'll tell you what. Oh, that's a bit too hot. <sighs> no grip up there. the wheel but when you got someone on your outside you can't do it yeah, you hit the bottom and it just grips up the old slide job we just about pulled it off yeah this car is so good on worn tires and trust me that has been a rarity this season yeah been really good on the short run for the most part and then struggled on long runs but today seems like it's the AI where their tires off they get slower and we seem to just about stay the same Jesus, man. Come on. I'm still side by it all of a sudden. Jesus. Alright, maybe that change wasn't a good idea after all. Oops. Tried to crisscross us there. 20 laps to go. 
We're gonna have to stop here in a sec. Six laps of fuel left. Green flag pit stops on the cards. I have not <laughs> not practiced my pit entry, so I have no idea how we're gonna pull this off, but just have to guess it and hope for the best. Just don't spin, that's the goal. Bruh, you knobhead. Hit that cushion. Cushion. Why well, keep calling it a cushion? It's a fucking apron. Knobhead. Ah, oh, caution's out anyway. Alright, perfect timing. Good to go to the finish now of stage number three. Let's just see if we can hold on to these three, at least in the short run. Back of him, pushed up the track again. Got a car grip up there. <coughs> Bruh. It's not gone well. Terrible restart. Going for a ride, Bowman. Yep, that's it. Get on up, boy. Nailed that one. Right, ah, you stop hitting the bloody apron, idiots. Sorry, I'm just. Getting all my state, uh, mistakes out of the way for this final stage. That's all I'm. That's all I'm doing. Drive like shit now. Drive like. Well, never mind. <laughs> my brain literally cannot think and talk at the same time. I don't know how people do it. Think and think and talk. Think and drive. See, I can't <laughs> talk and drive. Think, talk and drive. Yeah, there we go. Think, talk and drive. That's what I meant to say.
definitely got some pace here. Final couple changes I made on that last pit stop. I really got this car hooked up now. Tell you what, we have a shot at the stage. If we can clear Kurt and get on with it. The track is really coming into life now. It's also helping us out. Pushing up the racetrack. Starting to lose the side sort of bite of the tyres right now. I can't get a good runoff of here so we can get him into three. That's good, that's good, that's good. We have the lead. See if we can hold it for just two more laps. Or one more lap. Finally get a stage win. We come close twice already. Off of turn number four. Woo! Things are looking good. Stage three win. Got 50 odd laps to go. Just repeat what we've done in this stage. We should be looking good. All right. All right, so we've been jumped in the pits. Unfortunately, Eric Jones has gone back out in front of us. However, last time we started off second, we did actually manage to get in front. Hit these gear shifts. 47 laps to go. This Mustang has been on rails all day. Just gotta try and clear him before three, come on. Come on. Damn it. Clear him. Bottom is so much quicker on these restarts. get clear of anyone. Can't get down there. Ah, shit. I was going to grip up and be good there. That's right. No damage. Just let us up as all.
Ah, uh, caution's out. It's interesting. Some people pitting, some people aren't. We've got 34 laps yet. Yeah, so we'll pit so we can get to the end. Yeah, we are restarting fifth. So, Bowman stayed out. It's pretty keen. It's going to be a messy restart with a guy on old tyres on the bottom. Oh, come on. Just got to try and get by him on the back stretch, I reckon. Worked out like I planned. Ah, it's the bottom, come on. Ah, go away. Stupid freaking apron. Uh, just got a tap from the 11. Just gonna push wide. Uh, another one. Oh my god. Oh my god. Nah, we're done. Oh my days. Bruh. That has not gone well. This is going to cost us big time. <clears throat> well, that was the last thing we wanted, was to have a caution uh, and wreck out. So, starting from the back, but thankfully on NASCAR Heat 4 you can get all your damage fixed. So, we're just going to have to try and pass a whole field of cars in 25 laps. Good luck. Alright. Oh, my days. This is going to be a mess. So many cars we have to pass. I can't believe I did that. Such an idiot. Oh well. Comeback is on. Oh, uh, okay, yeah, <laughs> slightly rude, but gotta be aggressive in times like this. Desperate times, desperate measures. Ooh, three wide. Yeah, just door and everyone here <laughs> is kind of a uh, rude but anyway Stenhouse Ah. 
tap the brake and you just lock it all, uh, lock all fours up. I mean, it's just so annoying on this game. I hate the way it does that. Careful. Anyway. Oh, that's too early. Bruh, come on. Get your shit together. So bad. Squeeze. Well, we're up into top 15 after three or four laps, so we definitely got pace. I mean, we got newer tyres ish compared to everyone else, but it's not really that much newer. Ooh, hello, Jesus. Chase, let's go. Oh, okay. Real life, he'd be he'd be uh, facing the wrong way by now, but oh, such is NASCAR heat for. Um, ten laps to such a long way away. We need another caution, really. the front end. Couldn't make my mind up whether to go high or go low, but could sort of pass him. Ugh. Come on, frame rate, sort it out. Ah, oh, yes. Needed that caution. Uh, no, we're not going to pit. But unfortunately, we're starting on the outside. Did not want to restart on the outside. I just have to wing it. Coming to the green, driver. Be ready here. Come on. Alright, I managed to get down to the bottom, so it's a good start. Aggressive. <laughs> Ooh, squeeze. Oh my god, we actually might have a chance of winning this. I tell you what, guys, we may have just lucked out big time with that final caution. We have got much newer tyres and much more pace than the guys around us. Just got to find a way to stick it in front of this 20 and hold it. Five to go. He's taking the inside away. No, 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 don't hit the... Fence, you toss pot. Ugh. Man, today, to be honest, I have just driven like absolute shit today. This has been by far one of my worst performances this year. Alright. Let's try that again, shall we? Check up off of that corner. Careful, still there. Come on. Stay low, stay low. Right. Slide job. Woo! We have the lead. Ah, come on, idiot. Two to go. Come 
on, come on, come on, come on. Alright, last lap. Let's just get this thing across the finish line without making any more mistakes. Alrighty. Now we have got this locked down. I reckon it's seriously, seriously locked out with that caution. But to be honest, I mean, a win's a win, but I have driven like absolute shit today. That was a terrible, terrible drive, but a win's a win. Oh, man, that was a long race. Coke 600, baby. Man, this has uh, been going for like two hours and 15 minutes. That is a long run. Wow. Alrighty, well, thanks guys for tuning in. This has been another NASCAR Heat 4 video. Managed to grab a win around here at Charlotte. Man, we are just tearing it up in this Cup Series this year. I'm hoping on NASCAR Heat 5 they actually up the sort of AI difficulty a little bit because, yeah, there are some tracks where it's like ridiculously hard and there's some tracks where it's just ridiculously easy. But today it's actually been pretty good. I mean, we had basically battles for the lead the entire race so actually a really fun race all in all but anyway thanks guys for tuning in stay tuned for more nascar heat 4 content coming up soon to be nascar heat 5 and yeah until next time i'll catch you guys later